Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. Yoruba actress Liz Anjari's name seems to be on the lips of many Nigerians today. It all began during a live session on her Instagram page. And the mom of two said she can swear with everything that her husband, Mr. Lawal, has not slept with another woman since they became man and wife. And in her words, Latif is a decent man to the core. He might have his own attitude, no one is perfect, but while he's strong-willed and stubborn, but that he would ridicule me by sleeping around with other ladies is impossible. I can swear with everything that since we married, he has not cheated on me or slept with another woman. This was what she said, and it has sparked reactions among Nigerians. Some people are saying that it is impossible owing to his records, while some other people are asking questions. These are some of the reactions. The social media user with a handle Google Man on Gist Mania commented, Problem is looming. Another person who wants to stay anonymous commented, Polygamous man is equal to cheater slash disloyal slash greedy. It is in man. And Jado Edo Bib also commented, Continue to swear as he's plotting. Also, Anonymous added, the only type of woman that deserves a faithful man is a virgin. As long as you have given your private to different men of the past, you don't deserve a faithful man. Dislike my comments all you like, but it is a fact. So know how yours are not going to do outside, just that this game is tight. Another anonymous commented, maybe trouble has even started on paradise. She's coming here to praise the man, those who are genuinely happy in their relationship. Don't speak it online. They understand the values of protecting what they hold. Another anonymous, but he cheated on his wife with you, Lizzie, and then you became wife number two or three. So which one do you have to actually say he's not sleeping with his legitimate wife or otherwise? I don't get it. Would that be classed as cheating? Abimbola Utman, how is that our business? Keep your family life to yourselves. Another anonymous, so much confidence. Please, Mr. Husband, don't destroy this trust and confidence. Another person commented, Sister is sounding so confident about her husband being faithful. Well, be careful or a mistress may come out the bunk in your claim. Then you will come across looking like a donkey. Just saying. This is another person commented. Another anonymous, what about his other wives? Did he abandon them? Another person added, is he supposed to cheat on you? Our society celebrates rascality. Women, please don't make yourselves look like this. It is a standard. Another person, a man with several wives. Some things are not just meant to be on social media. Another person, I've seen the most disciplined men cheat. You can never tell. And even if you think he's so faithful, why bring it to social media? Vicky also had it. What a beautiful marriage. Keep it on, Mr. Lawal. It pays to be faithful, wishing you guys happiness all the time. So these are some of the reactions from Nigerians as it gets this little utterance from Lizzie and John. As you all know, Mr. Lawal already had about three baby mamas with kids before he eventually tied the knot with Lizzie and John. In fact, they have been friends for about 14 good years. He was at the background. Meanwhile, in another news, a while ago, some people had attacked the star actress of flaunting her husband always on social media. And she had said that she publicly displeased her husband for business reasons and not necessarily to show off. This was in an interview with Saturday Beats. And she said that they, I'm a very private person. The only reason I post my dance videos and pictures of my husband is for my business. If not for that, I would not even be on social media. I run a clothing line and I make male and female clothes. I only use my husband as a male model for my business because he's not in favor of me using male models. If I could keep my grown up daughter off social media, it would not be hard for me to keep my marriage off it. Many of the people will now complain that I'm showcasing my husband due to her public displays of affection on Instagram. 
were the same ones who bullied the innocent and easygoing man after our secret wedding was leaked by their kind. If a woman is married and she does not display a man, people will begin to insinuate that the man has left and that they are no longer together. My husband, who loves to keep things personal, was bullied. Hence, I have taken it upon myself to press their necks with my show of love for my husband, posting pictures of us together online. If people observe foreign celebrities such as Rihanna, Beyonce, and Nicki Minaj, they realize that there are certain things expected of an entertainer. But unfortunately, some Nigerians are not well informed. Therefore, they find it hard to accept the reality of things across the world. I travel a lot. And I know that when one is traveling as a couple, the embassies would request for one social media handle. And a lot of opportunities could be made available to a person due to their social media activities. So, I also post those pictures because we got married not too long ago. And having information about one's marriage, partner, kids and business on social media makes things easier for people when traveling. I don't like show-offs. However, as a celebrity, one needs to put some things out there concerning one's life. I'll continue to post my husband. I don't care what anyone says. Not the only celebrity who post pictures or videos of her husband. Other celebrities do that too. And speaking on the need for women to be industrious, especially before venturing into marriage, she had this to say. In these modern times, a woman needs to have something worthwhile that she does. Being jobless or not having a business could trigger a man to start looking out for another woman who brings something to the table. It is good for a woman to be productive even if one is not rich. Full name is Elizabeth Aishat Hanjaran. She's a Nigerian actor, movie producer, predominantly making movies in the Yoruba sector of Nollywood. She began her acting career around 2009. She came to prominence around 2009-2010 and she's known for movies like Isho Nishe and Ariwa Ejo. Her self-produced movie was Tolani Barada and others include Gold, Yawa Buke, Kofo Tinubu, Kofo the First Lady, O Narabet. She's also a fashion designer and sells clothes and accessories. When we come to the end of this episode where Nigerians will act as the actress Lizzie Andrew shocks them with these utterances on social media and they are expressing their opinion, please subscribe and hit the bell icon for our daily content.